work. You should definitely try out for the diving team next year. <laughs> and the dance team. College students are graduating into one of the worst job markets in U.S. history. A recent study concluded that 40% of millennials are unemployed. That's more than any other age group. This documentary is an exploration of what happens when you graduate from Princeton with honors, but life isn't the cakewalk that you imagined. <laughs> Does she know you're doing this? Yeah, kind of. I mean, you know, I film everything, so it's mm. not really different. Okay. Mm -hmm. Don't tell her though, I'll tell her. <laughs> <laughs> ridiculous. But I didn't spill anything on it, it just broke. If it just breaks on its own, then they have to fix it, right? Right, but when we opened it up, the hard drive did not suggest that it just broke on its own. But it did. I was just doing some work on my modeling portfolio and it just broke. It made a noise like, you know? Ma'am, it smelled like Pinot. That's impossible. I only drink Merlot. Maddie, I thought I told you not to have your weird little friend film in here anymore. Get out of here. Hey. Hey. Introduce yourself. I don't want to do that right now. I'm trying to show you something. Come on, please. Please introduce yourself, please. Hi, I'm Maddie Sanford. Come on, see the room. Maddie graduated from Princeton at the top of her class, speaks four languages, is brilliant with computers, and is an amazing friend for letting me film her for my documentary about the road to success. <laughs> okay, fine, come on, you want to show me something on your computer? This isn't my computer. That lady today, you know, the model. Mm -hmm. This is technically just a copy of her hard drive. What? I told her if I brought it home, I might be able to recover some of her data, easy peasy. <laughs> oh but my God. then, wait, I wait. found her website. Oh my <laughs> God, stop it. Bambi. Just, just wait. Wait? <laughs> Did you just ruin her website? Oh, come on. She deserves it for being such a dick to me at the store. Do anyway, you... she can put it back. It's just going to take a while. <laughs> How did you do that so fast? I'm a genius. Alex, it's helped me finally figure out what I'm supposed to do. Think about it. I'm going to join the CIA. Hey, guys. <sighs> what are you guys looking at? Nothing. Just looking at cat pics. Oh, let me see. Oh, we just finished. You just finished looking at cat pics? OK. Um, I'm going to go to Whole Foods to get a juice, Alex. Actually, we're having dinner at my parents' house tonight. Tag us in a photo of it on Instagram. It'll be like we had it together. Hashtag health, hashtag dinner, hashtag life, hashtag love. Are you making fun of me right now? Uh, we can catch up with you later. Like, maybe we'll go watch a movie or something. Yeah, okay. Enjoy your kale. Dude, you are so mean. I can't help it. She's just such an easy target. You know she just wants to hang out with us. Uh, well, I don't want to hang out with her. <gasps> you're such a bitch. <laughs> you don't want to hang out with her either. You'd Alex. make the perfect CIA agent because you're such a bitch. Ta -da, ta -da, ta -da. Our little artist. What's the film about this time? Maddie, actually. Whatever for. Come on, Mom, I'm starving. You know the rules, no cameras at the table. I told you I'm working on a plan B. That job is just a stepping stone. That place is a dead end. It's the kind of job that you can get trapped in. Jesus, even Alex is working at that production company. How's that going, by the way? Uh, it's, it's good, yeah. See, at least at a place like that, there's opportunity for growth, even if it's shit pay for a pipe dream. Maddie, you're wasting your- I said I've got it under control. I don't need you guys harassing me every time I come here like I'm your failed investment. I don't show up and interrogate you about how your couple's therapy is going. Let's state your name and occupation. Can we do this naked? I think I'd feel more comfortable if, if you were naked. <laughs> hey, I'm uh, Justin Pearson. I teach seventh grade math at Wilson Junior High School. <laughs> Get serious. You graduated two years ago. Hmm. Was it difficult for you to find a job in the career of your choice? I got very lucky. Uh, shortly after I graduated, I got a great job at a great school. And you've known Maddie since high school. Where did you think she'd be after Princeton? <laughs> I don't know, President. <laughs> Do you think it's weird that, like, I have a real job and she doesn't? Jesus, Alex, what does that have to do with your documentary? So they really just let you apply online? I feel like that's 
too easy. Well, this is just the first step application. Then there's this whole background check, but I'm above and beyond all the basic requirements, so I should hear back within 45 days. Dude, this job is totally for you. You're so perfect for it. Here, here, stand up, stand up. <coughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to present to you the future of the CIA, Miss Maddie Sanford. And I'd like to thank the Academy in advance. <laughs> Any last words to mark the occasion? I would be completely honored to be a part of the American justice system. I cannot think of a better use of my hard work and exceptional talents. And I'm looking forward to help keep America safe from criminals and other scumbags. <laughs> I'm just gonna cut after safe because scumbags is not a technical term. Okay, I'm gonna submit it now. Oh, okay, okay. Um, okay. Yeah, focus and go ahead. <sighs> Thank you for your application. Friends, family, individuals, or organizations may be interested to learn that you are an applicant or an employee of the CIA. Their interest, however, may not be benign or in your best interest. You cannot control whom they would tell. We therefore ask you to exercise discretion and good judgment in disclosing your interest in a position with the agency. What? Asshole. I think you're too pretty to be in the CIA. I'm sorry. It'd be perfect for an alias. What are you talking about? Oh, that's true. No one would Stupid. ever expect such a gorgeous woman to be a spy. That only happens in the movies. So right now we're doing spy practice. Yeah, this is my first clandestine op. And we're tailing my boyfriend, Justin. Totally think she's up to something. She doesn't really have any other friends, you know? She's probably just like banging an old guy. Her boss, maybe. Taylor is totally the kind of chick that bangs her boss. What a party it's right here, right on the street. We're almost there right now. It's going to be amazing. There is a bounce house. Sorry, guys. We're in the middle of a steakhouse. We'll be going all out. Act like we're made. Ain't getting paid. But rock and a chain will throw it all down. Break in the bank. We ain't afraid to live like Beyonce. No. All over his shoes. You are crazy. I did not. Oh, my God. You liar. Oh, oh, go, go, go. He's turning right, he's turning right. I got it, I got it. Do you, though? Yes, I do. What would you do without me? Wait, isn't this Justin's house? Oh, oh, weird. He told me he was going to Josh's. Maybe he forgot something. The CIA's most valuable asset, Maddie Sanford. That's right. Go, 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 go. Let's go, let's go. Slowest CIA agent. <gasps> Down. Oh, tell the door to stop. Great. You gotta shut up, man. <laughs> stop talking. Let me hear you. I don't care. I care. This is serious stuff. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I don't want to fail the mission. I'm sorry. Don't. Dun, dun, dun. Alex, no. Oh my god, is that Taylor? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh shit, Alex. Uh, oh my god, 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 oh my god. Oh, Alex. Hey. Look who's filming again. Yeah, I gotta check in on your progress. Any word yet? Is that him? Don't pick it up. Don't. Hello? Wait, what? No. No, Justin, why would I do that? What? I, I, no, I wouldn't want you to get fired. Hello? What did you do with my footage? I just thought you'd be happy. Why would I be happy? I just thought it would be a fun revenge prank. I didn't know he would get fired. What did you think the response was gonna be from a bunch of parents seeing that footage? I guess I wasn't really thinking about that, you know? I was just thinking about cause and effect. Daddy. Actions have consequences. I didn't want him to not have any. Babe, you were my best friend. And he hurt you. I wanted him to pay for it. <sighs> this kind of stuff is the real reason I want to join the CIA. I want to be one of the good guys. I want to be one of the people who catches the Justins and the cheaters and the liars. You're not going to get into the CIA. 
Dude, would you get, get out, out of here? Okay, I just came in here to tell you guys that I found a place and I'll be out of here by Friday. Great. Leave us alone till then. You know, the CIA wouldn't hire someone who actively wanted to join. It's a conflict of interest. Think about it. What kind of person would seek that job out? Only a crazy person, right? You know what? None of us asked you for your opinion, okay. Taylor. I'm gone. Do you think it's true, what she said? No. You seem upset. No. But you're like wearing the same clothes. And Why are you filming me right now? You think I'm gonna give up? You wanna film me when I give up? Well, I'm not giving up. What does Taylor know about the CIA? Nothing. They're probably watching me right now. Watching me all the time since I applied, you'll see. Hey, Alex. Hey, Maddie. Hey. Uh, what are you working on? Uh, just studying. I'm trying to figure out who all the major players of the other governments are. Oh. Are you going to work today? No, I'm not doing that anymore. It's a waste of time. Here, help me hold this. Uh... Hey, can you help me hold this? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Again? You're welcome. I got it! No way! Let me see! No! I just mean I think the less you're involved, the better. You read what it said online. Look, I know you don't want to talk to me right now, but your friend is losing her shit, and you need to do something besides film it happening. Are you seriously judging me? No, it's just someone needs to do something or she's gonna turn into Amanda Bynes. What am I supposed to do, Taylor? I don't know. Call her parents, get her locked up. <laughs> okay, you know what? I've known Maddie a lot longer than you, so you could just stay out of this, okay? Because we don't give a shit about your opinion. Okay, fine. I was just trying to find some way to say I'm sorry. <laughs> There is literally no apology from you that I want. Unless you want to be on my documentary and apologize on camera for fucking my boyfriend. Why don't you keep your mouth shut about Maddie, who in fact just heard from the CIA? I'll be out tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, you will. Come on, what are you doing? <sighs> Sorry, I just wanted to make sure she did a good job painting the walls. Don't want to have a problem with our security deposit if she messed up the room. Mm. Are you sure this is a good idea? Yes, come on, it'll be fun. Besides, I think I really need to get out of the house. I've been kind of cooped up since I stopped going to work. Oh, well, show us your new toy. Ah! <laughs> Dude, that's crazy. So awesome. Come on, let's go. Spy practice number three. Let's go, Agent Sanford. Agent Sanford. Dun, 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 dun. I'm here when you need me. <laughs> Cheesiest line ever. Let's go. Seven, Edward, Victor, Armed robbery. Petty theft. Assault with a deadly weapon. Man, you've gotten really good at this. If they don't get in CIA, maybe I go into regular law enforcement. This one's boring. We can't see anything. Let's get closer. Come on. I don't know. Maddie! Wait, wait, did you hear that? Those are just the ambulance codes. No, no, the address. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, what the hell? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Taylor. Ma'am, please stay out of the way. Wait, uh, it, it, what happened? Is she gonna be okay? Are you family? We're her roommates. Yeah. Electrical fire. Police said there was a problem with the wiring in her laptop, caused the overheat and explode. Oh my God. Wait, wait, her laptop? Please stand back.
Dear Maddie Sanford, we are delighted to accept you into the Central Intelligence Agency. Oh my god. When I first started making this documentary, I wasn't completely honest with Maddie about why I was making it. And the more I think about it, I, I wasn't completely honest with myself either. And now I'm forced to confront the idea that my best friend has become seriously ill. So I'm stopping this project and I'm gonna try to get her some help. And if something should happen to me, Well, God, I've, I have no fucking idea what you should do with this tape. I have no fucking idea what you should do with this tape. Hey, Joan, thank you so much for calling me back. Oh, no, 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 not sick, like, uh, physically sick. Um, I actually don't want to talk about it here. Can I come over? Well, when are you back? Okay, uh, I guess I can wait till tomorrow. Actually, we're good with our cable service. We don't need any more channels. Thank you. I don't know how many times I gotta tell those guys. Uh, I got you something. Oh, you didn't have to do that. I know, I just, I know I've been really difficult lately to deal with and I'm gonna say thank you for being such a patient, amazing friend. Oh, wow, that's beautiful, thank you. Here, let me help you put it on. Oh, okay. It looks great on you. I knew it would. Get her some help. She's gonna be fine. This really sucks, Alex. You know this isn't what I wanted, but actions have consequences. You made the choice to betray me, and now you're going to have to pay for that choice. The CIA needs me. The United States needs me. I'm a very important person and can't let you get in the way of that no matter how much I love you.
I'm so sorry you couldn't be happy for me. Los Angeles police have been searching for a missing woman since Friday. 25-year-old Alexandra Wong was last seen by her roommate leaving their apartment around midnight. Police have found suicidal journal entries on Wong's laptop. While the search for her continues, all suspicions of foul play have been nullified. Alex did not commit suicide. Don't stop searching. She's out there. She's such a beautiful person, and I just think that you find her. Interviews being recorded for internal purposes. Can I go ahead and get your consent? I consent. State your name for the camera. Maddie Sanford. Do you know why you're here? <laughs>